If the weather holds out, there could be a lot of families on the lakes today. Unfortunately, there could also be some children with life jackets that are just not sized right. So before you head out, let's take a look back at some advice Alicia got from the Minnesota DNR. As eager as Minnesotans are to hit the lakes this summer, the Minnesota DNR wants to remind folks before they hit the water to check the status of their life jackets. If you're, you know, stopped by a conservation officer or um, any, you know, water patrol, they're going to look to make sure it's U.S. Coast Guard approved, that it fits, that everybody on the boat has one. Kids under 10 are required to wear them when they're in the boat, so find one that's comfortable for your kid, that it makes sense for what, you know, what you're doing on the boat. Even the smallest passengers on board need one, so parents out there, you're not only looking for that Coast Guard certification, but also a life jacket based on your kid's height and weight. Lisa Dugan, the Recreation Safety Outreach Coordinator with the Minnesota DNR, shows us how to make sure your life jacket is the perfect fit. So a couple ways to test is pulling up, and if the life jacket comes above, her, above their ears, that's going to be too big, because look at what happens if she fell into the water. Put your arms up real. Oh, and that's going to slip right off. It's called the ear test, and it takes less than a minute to test the jacket's fit. So that's not going to come up above her ears. That's going to be a good fit for her, and it's not going to come off when she's in the water. Yeah, interesting to see it visually there and, and just how tight that jacket should be. A life jacket labels can be a tad confusing as well. So what used to be based off of different levels for your boating activity is now based on the scale and level of buoyancy. So for example here, what you would see printed inside the uh, life jacket here. The lower the number signifies that you should be closer to shore. And if you're doing some sort of water sports in the middle of the lake, those jackets will be in the 150 range. So just keep that in mind. A lot of you are going to be on the lake today. Just want to make sure you're safe out there. 648, let's get to